Thousands of firefighters continued their efforts to extinguish over 100 wildfires in northern Portugal on Wednesday. Seven people have died since the worst spate of fires in recent years spread out of control over the weekend. Portuguese Prime Minister Luís Montenegro declared a state of calamity for the hardest-hit areas late on Tuesday, invoking powers to mobilize more firefighters and civil servants. He also called on police investigators to redouble their efforts to find those who started the fires and pledged help for those who have lost their homes or have been evacuated. The European Copernicus Satellite Service said that over 15,000 hectares had been scorched and a combined 13 kilometers of fire fronts had been detected as on Tuesday night. It added that an area home to 210,000 people was exposed to the fire risk. The hot, dry conditions behind the outbreaks in Portugal coincided this week with flooding in Central Europe. Spain's military sent 240 soldiers and vehicles from its emergency response battalion specialized in combating fires to its neighbor. For water dumping planes from France, two from Spain and two from Italy were deployed after answering an appeal to help their fellow EU member. Morocco likewise responded to a request by Portugal with two water dumping planes that arrived on Wednesday. Three firefighters died in their vehicle on Tuesday while another had succumbed to what authorities called a sudden illness while on duty over the weekend. Three civilians have also perished, according to civil protection authorities. Experts link the fires to both climate change and the abandonment of traditional farming and forestry professions that helped keep rural areas clear of underbrush that is now fuel for fires. Espero que o dia aqui neste.